Hi, I'm Mark Eaton from the Eaton Leadership Foundation with a special word today from Jesus Calling about our tendency to fix things in our lives where only God can do the repairs that are really needed. Our featured excerpt from Jesus Calling gives us encouragement when we become overwhelmed with all that's, well, wrong in our world, and then we start trying to fix things. Don't weigh yourself down with responsibilities that are not your own. Instead, make your relationship with me your primary concern. Rather than trying to fix everything that comes to your attention, ask me to show you what's truly important. One of the favorite things I like to say to men when I speak at a conference is, fix things, love people. Over the years, I've been privileged to serve on some great teams, and teams can get a lot done, and if working well, can get a lot done smoothly and quickly. I, I love teams a lot. Sometimes, though, there can be a breakdown in a team, and one person maybe isn't necessarily carrying the weight the rest of the team expected, and the team begins to suffer. We can confront that person and blame them, and maybe even shame them for the team's failure, but there might be a better way. When you think about fixing things and loving people, this is a principle we've adapted about how God works with us with gentleness. He provides a strong and firm course of action, one which we're aware of our own failings, and that helps our team members get back on track without blaming or shaming anyone. So fix the things in your world. Absolutely fix those. Get them taken care of. Take care of your business, guys. You know that. But when it comes to people, love the people. Fix the things, love the people.